for today's lessons, lesson, we are going to make a collagram drawing. A collagram is the art of creating a picture using font. So the first thing you need to do is think of an object and draw the outer shape or line of that object. I decided to draw a shark. Try and draw just the outside lines, no details like a face or eyes or anything like that. I wouldn't draw any gills on my shark. Nothing on the inside of your figure or shape, whatever you're drawing. You're only drawing like the silhouette or the outline of that object. It can be a person, place, or, I'm sorry, not a person. It could be a animal, it could be an object, it could be anything. Look at the examples in the PowerPoint to show some different, to give you an idea of some different things that you can make. When I'm done drawing the outside, I erase all of the lines where my fins and tail overlap so that I have just the outer outline of my object. Once I have that, I practice making my bubble letters on a separate piece of paper. I draw the regular letter and then I draw a bubble around it. And I practice drawing each letter of the, the word. My figure, my object, was a shark. So I'm spelling out the word shark in bubble letters. Once you have that, you want to use up the entire space inside of the object to create the word. So notice how my letter touches all the areas of my shark. It fills up everything. So does my H. While drawing this, I realized that my word was going to be a lot shorter than my object was. I ran out of letters, so I decided to make two, three exclamation marks at the end of my word to really emphasize that there's a shark coming! Once you get done drawing your object and the letters inside of it, you're going to color with either colored pencil or crayon on the inside. There's no requirements on color. You can color your letters however you want. I made sure to color my letters darker and heavier than I did the background behind my letters of the shark. This project took me a very long time. It probably took me about an hour to create it from start to finish. So I had to speed this up a lot to make this video. After you're done coloring in your word object, you can cut it out, put it on a piece, glue it to a piece of construction paper, or you can decorate the background. I cut out a stencil 
to of another shark to put in my background and to make it look like there was a whole school of sharks. I traced it several times in the background and then I colored it with marker to fill in the back area, like to make it look like water. You can use markers, crayons, colored pencil for this part. The main part of the picture is to learn how to draw words inside of a shape. So however you decorate it is up to you. I can't wait to see what you guys come up with and what objects you choose to make your word collagraph, collagram in. <laughs>